Evening all, Rich here, back for part 3 of this MS Batori tutorial. Uh, today's focus is the sort of the beginnings of the ship's superstructure. I think we might be able to get about three decks worth of the superstructure done today. But we'll see. Uh, so we'll focus on the main deck and then sort of inside walls and things like that. So uh, that's the, pro uh, the process for today. So what we're going to do first is to add uh, the first of the two main decks. So as I thought I mentioned there are two of these. So we're going to go to the back end of the ship and we'll start there. And I'm just wondering what that noise is behind me. I think the wind's starting to get up. That's not me farting, that's just the wind outside. <laughs> um, so what we're going to do, we're going to go right to the back end of the ship. And we're going to add our first deck. So we'll go down to the very back end. And the deck is going to be, um, I think it's one block below the top. Yeah, so we're going to go to the back end of the ship. And the deck is going to go one block below the top of the hull. So start adding the deck, back end of the ship, like so. I think that's where it goes. So I think that's uh, about right. Let me just check on the prototype. I have written this down, but I can't remember. I can't, I can't see exactly where I have written it. So, yeah. So I put the deck one block below the top. So I just fly back over. La, 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 la. So, yeah. So start adding the deck. This will be the first one because there will be another one that goes on top. So I start adding the deck here at the back end. This will go all the way to the front of the ship. So, as you can see, there's one block below the top of the hull on the stern on the back of the ship. So you can see back of the ship. Let's just start, start adding the deck there. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use the world editor for this one. So I'm going to use the fill tool. And this deck is going to go right the way to the front end. So as you can see, I've added the first few blocks. So just carry on that deck all the way to the front end. And this is going to take about, you know, three months to do it. So I should use the fill tool. So fill uh, wood by 400, even though 400 is a slight exaggeration. But this deck should go all the way to the front end and we shouldn't have to worry so this may require a jump cut I don't know right okay there's the deck added and that uh, took a bit longer than I expected but never mind so there we are there's the deck added and you can see at the back end here it's just one block below the top that's how we wanted it but further back or further forward rather the deck is sort of much below much further below the, uh, the side of the ship just because the sides of the ship go up and down if you know what I mean so that's the uh, that's all that bit done so um, I'm just going to check make sure the deck has gone all the way forward and yeah, it looks like it has so that's fine uh, so that's the lower deck done so we'll, we'll come back and sort out the other deck in a bit but we're going to sort out the uh, the inside walls first so we're going to go back to the back end of the ship and we're going to build some inside walls so we'll go to the very tip of the stern the back end of the ship and on the wood on the inside this block here isn't wood because it's uh, black so you can replace that with wood if you want to so that's what I would do so we've got a wood block in there. So we're going to count that as number one now. And what we're going to do, we're going to count forward uh, to the sixth block on the wood. So that's the first block, two, three, four, five, and six. So on the sixth block forward, we'll put a red block, which should be concrete, but it's come out as, uh, I don't know, come out as uh, wool. So I'll just change that, actually. La, 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 dee, dee. There we go. So we didn't need wool, we want concrete. So we'll make that... Uh, a red centre block, so sixth forward we'll put our wood block there and then we want to build this wall here five wide, so that is two either side, like so and then for the sides you want to go out two and two again and same the other side, two and two again, like that so you've got a sort of shape like that, and then you're going to build forward and we're going to build forward two, one, two, and then forward three rows of four, so one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And then five, one, two, two, three, four, five. And then six, one, two, three, four, five, six. And then four, one, two, three, four. And then you go outwards, uh, out three, one, two, three, like that. And that's where you want your walls. So do the same on the other side quick. So it's the three rows of four, or two, two forward rather. So two forward, and then the three rows of four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And the five, one, two, three, four, five, and then the six, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then the four, one, two, three, four, and then out three, one, two, three, like so. And then what you want to do is increase those walls to three blocks high all the way around. So just do this all the way around. So I'll do one side and then I'll copy it across. So I just want to build it three high, like so, all the way around. And when we come to add the deck on top, the deck will sit on top of these walls and everything should all be fine. That's the theory anyway. 
So there, well, there's half of it done, so I'm just going to quickly copy that to the other side. So just get our copy paste down to that point there, and then what I do, I quickly copy it. So copy, flip to the right, and then we paste like that. And there we go, there's our walls added. And uh, it should look something like that. <laughs> that's the theory anyway. So that's that bit done. And now what we're going to do is add the upper deck, well not add the deck, but add the overhang of the uh, sort of open promenade here. And what we want to do is go back to the black part. It doesn't matter which side you're on because it's, it's the same on both sides. So I'm actually I'll do the left side. So we go to the end of where the highest point of the black hull ends. So it's not really difficult, not really easy to see. But you've but you got the lower deck there where we just added the deck. And then you've got this vertical part where the, where the black hull goes up. So we go to the end of that, the back end of it. And on the inside we want to add, I think it's, I think it's five blocks. So we go one, two, three, four, five. And make it six. So there we go. So as long as it follows the contours of the wall of the, the the hull below, it should be okay. So add six on the inside, so it follows up to the end of the section below. As you can see, it's in line like that. So it's six there, and then we want to add six again. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then five. One, two, three, four, five, and then four. One, two, three, four, four again. One, two, three, four, four again. One, two, three, four. And then three, one, two, three, three again, one, two, three. Then then three rows of two, one, two, one, two, one, two. And then inwards two, one, two. And then uh, inwards two again, one, two, like that. And then a coloured centre block to mark the centre like that. And there you go, that is the overhang. You can't really see it very well because it's, it's all black, but it's, it's an overhang of where the deck will end on the, on the upper deck. So that's that. So I did the same on the other side. So go on the inside again, add six. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and then six, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then five, one, two, three, four, five, three rows of four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and then two rows of three, one, two, three, one, two, three, and then three rows of two, one, two, one, two, one, two, inwards two, one, two, and inwards two, one, two, again. There we go. So that's both sides done. And it should look something like that, and it don't look too bad, do it? And when we when we do come to add the deck, the deck will sit uh, inside, like so. But we're not going to worry about that just yet because we've got to get the folks out of the way. But before we do that, if we go underneath where that row, that first row of black six started, in uh, just inside the, the inside the hull there, what you're going to do underneath, you're going to add, uh, I think it's th uh, three black blocks. So one, two, three, like. That three like that and then on top of that three again like that so it just makes this section slightly shorter but just or, or, or the, the higher section slightly longer so just add two rows of three underneath and do the same underneath as well on the other side so one two three there one two three like that and there you go it just makes that section slightly longer and uh, there we go so that's that section done there so what we're going to do now we're going to go to the front end of the ship and start with the forecastle which has a shear so it's, it slopes upwards so I don't know why I'm doing the hand gestures of the sloping, but uh, there we go. So what we're going to we're gonna do, go to the very tip of the bow on the inside. And for the wood, we're going to add on the... We're going to count down on the uh, tip of the bow. So if tip of the bow is on the inside here. And count down to the fourth block down. So one, two, three, and four. And there's where we add our first wood block. So there's that bit there. And for the forecastle itself, we're going to add 12. So that's the first block there. We add 12, so 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then underneath that, we want 18. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. And then underneath that, we want 18 again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. And then underneath that is where the main deck is. So this block here. We go all the way, or this line, we go all the way to the back end of what we just built. So that is the height of the main deck. So I just build it outwards to the side so we get the full width of what would be the main deck. So this would be the, the border basically. So, as I say, this section we just built here all the way out to the side, you just want to build that all the way to the back end of uh, the overhang at the back end. So that is that section there. So these sections up here, these these higher sections, you just want to build these out to the side as well. And start filling in these raised decks. So just do one on one side. And I know this is not strictly accurate to the real ship, or any real ship, but uh, remember this is me building it, 
and nothing I've built is accurate anyway so there we go so there we go there's the first raised deck there and you do the same with the next next section below so just build the section out to the side and fill all this one in and what I'll do I'll do one side at a time otherwise I'll be here all bloody day doing this There we go. This is the next section, half done. You can see I've done done half of it, and then you just do the same thing with the next section. So um, we we'll just uh, put a line across the top of this bit here, and just so we get a border, and then just fill this section in as well. This will be another raised deck, and that just goes all the way up to the next section there. And then, the, like I was saying, the section below, which is the main deck now, we we'll just go all the way to the back end, and that should uh, be okay. So what I'm going to do, I do a, a quick jump cut while I. Um, fill out these decks and then uh, we can move on so uh, back in a moment right okay back again so I've done the first three sections of the raised deck on the bow so it looks something like that so one the, the top part there then it goes down a couple and then I haven't added the main deck yet but uh, as long as you see how those bits are done I've also added center blocks as well on each uh, section as well it's just to, for marker so I know where the center is so what we're going to do now is just add the main deck going all the way back so I shall stand on a block over here and let's just fill this main deck going all the way back so that should go from here all the way down to the back end uh, of the raised section we built a minute ago and should cover up the main uh, the, the inside walls and that's built pretty quick so there we go, there's the deck added there and it goes all the way down to the back end of that raised section we built a minute ago so it should go and connect up quite nicely and there you go, see so yeah, that's how it should be, so there we go, the deck's gone all the way to the back end and it don't look too bad. So there's the inside walls there now covered up. And what you can do now, as before, and with you know the usual stuff, you can start adding the doors and windows if you like. So let's get our doors. I so said it's not necessary at the moment, but you can do this whenever you want. But I'll do it. I'll start doing it now anyway. So I put a few, a couple of doors, and then sort of windows without doing too much damage. So a pair of win, a pair of doors, and sort of three or four windows. Depends what you want to do, and uh, I sort of place my window sort of every other every two blocks if you know what I mean. And uh, down to the back end, like so. So that's one side of the windows and doors done there. Like I say, it's not something you have to do in that order or in that uh, design, but it's up to you what you want to do. But I'm just going to quickly copy this to the other side anyway. Um, so to there we do copy. Flip to the other side and right uh, paste. And there we go. There's the doors and windows on the other side. So like I say, it's something you can do, or you can do your own design. It's up to you. But it's you know, it's not anything, it's anything special. But uh, there we go. So anyway, that's the door. That's the doors and windows done there, and the upper deck added. So what we're going to do now is go down to the front end again, and we're going to go to the front of the main deck, not uh, not to the the very tip of the bow, but to where the the main deck raises slightly. So here's the main deck here and we're going to go to the first raised section uh, from the main deck. So looking back, or looking forward rather, you've got this first section here. And what we're going to do, we're going to count on this, on the next raised section here, we're going to count to the fourth block forward. So we'll go one, two, three, four, and we'll put a colour block to mark the centre. And we're going to build our first section of the superstructure, which should attach to these outside sections here. That's the theory at least. So we've got the centre block there, so fourth block forward, add the centre block. And we're going to build 11 wide, so that is 5 out each way. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 that way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 that way. And then we want um, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and then 2, 1, 2, and then back to 2, 1, 2, like that. And we're going over uh, the side of the, um, the, of the uh, race section there. So it's back to 2 like that. And then we want... Four, one, two, three, four, and then five, one, two, three, four, five, four again, no, five again, sorry, one, two, three, four, five, and then four, one, two, three, four, and then we want three rows of two, one, two, one, two, one, two, and then we want four, one, two, three, and four, like that, and that connects up with that white pillar there, 
at the front of the section there. So I quickly do the other side. So as it was out four, one, two, three, four, and then uh, two, one, two, and then back two, one, two, and then four, one, two, three, four, and then five, one, two, three, four, five, five again, one, two, three, four, five. Um, what was it? I can't remember. Oh, four, one, two, three, four, and then two, 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 one, two, one, two, one, two, and four, one, two, three, four, like that. And there we go. So that is the front of our superstructure, and it should look something like that. And what you want to do now is increase the height of these walls so that they're the same height as this block here. So you can build them all up. So the front front few sections will be three high because it's on the raised platform there. So I'll build these sections up first up to the end of the raised platform. So these will be three high. Like so. So yeah, so there's three high there. And then after the raised platform, because they go down by one block, these will be four high. And these will go all the way down to connect up to that white wall over there. So I just build one side and then I do the other side on copy paste. And there we go, there's one side done. You can see it attaches to that first block on the side of the white, and that's how it should be. That is fine. And it don't look too bad. So that's one side done. So what I'll do, I'm going to do the other side. Well, I'll do the other side off camera. So I'm going to do a jump cut when I sort out the other side. And I'll also do a bit more measuring so I know what we're doing in the next part, or the next uh, few minutes. So I shall return in just a moment. Right, back again. So that's both sides of that front superstructure done. Sorry, I'm a bit far away. Uh, those two sections done there. So that is all now increased in height, and it should, in theory, look something like that. Right, so what we're going to do now is uh, move away from here and go to the back end of the ship, and we've got to sort out some inside walls now. So we're going to go right to the back end, right to the end of the deck, and we're going to count forward. So go to the end of the deck onto the wood, which is right here, this first block here. And from there, we're going to count forward to the 25th block forward. So from the back end here, 20, oh, back end of this block, count 25 forward. So that's 5, 10, 15, 20, and 25 is there. So 25 forward, we'll add our center block. So you can see it's 25 forward like that. And then this back wall is going to be uh, 11 wide. So that's 5 either side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 that way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 that way. And then either side we want out three, one, two, three, and then two and two, uh, two. so it's three, two, two. Do the same on the other side. Three, two, and two, like that. And then from there you want to build forward four, one, two, three, four, and then eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And there's 17, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and then out 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, there, like that. So there, that's one side done. So you want to increase that to 3 high. I'll just do the other side quick. So increase those walls we just built to 3 high. I'll do that in a minute. But uh, i just sort out the other side. So it's forward 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and then 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And then 17, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. And out 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. There we go. So like I was saying, increase those all to four, uh, to 3 high now, all the way around. So I'll just do the first few, and then I'll probably do another jump cut. So I'll just put it 3 high all the way around. Uh, sit quartz. And it's going to be a bit of a pain in the ass to do. So like I said, I'll do the first few and then I'll do a jump cut just to get it out of the way. Otherwise, I'll be here all day. But yeah, you want three high all the way around this back end. And everything should all be okay. So I'll just do this up to the centre. So there we are. There's half of it done. So I'll quickly copy that to the other side. So bear with me a second. So quickly copy. Copy, 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 copy. So we want uh, copy again, then flip to the right or left, whichever way, and then paste. 
And there we go, that's the uh, back walls done. And like on the deck below, you can start adding the doors or windows if you like. It's entirely up to you. But uh, I shall, I'm going to leave the doors and windows for a bit. But like I said, they're basically the same layout as down here. So it's up to you if you want to copy that. Right, so I'm just going to scratch my head now and work out what we want to do. Um, and then what we want to do is to think for a minute. Uh, so what we're going to do is... I don't know, bear with me. Ah, right, so what we're going to do now, sorry, I'm just reading my notes. What we're going to do now is go to the very end of the white section on the top of the hull. So you've got this white wall which goes from the front to the back, or front to the, down the side of the uh, black hull, and it ends uh, just at this section here. So there's a three high section there. And on the deck level, just beyond that, we're going to add a line of blocks, and it's going to go in a line of 16. So just on the inside here of where the wall ends, we we'll add 16 back, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. And you only want to do it one block high, okay, so that's fine. So it's 16, and then we want 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And then 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then we want uh, 6. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And then 6 again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And then two, one, two, like that. And there you go. That's all you want. And that is a single block high section there, like so. You can't really see it very well, but uh, it's just on the side like that. And uh, we'll have pillars attached to that later on, so we'll get to that in a minute. But we'll just do the other side quick. So what was it we want? Uh, 16. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and then 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 2, 1, 2, like that, and there we go. That's that all done. All right, so, like I said, pillars will attach to that in a minute. Um, so what we're going to do now is go back to the centre of the back wall we just built. So we've got these back walls here we just built. We're going to go on the top and add some wood blocks, and we're going to add 5 wood blocks back, so back towards the stern. So on the top we'll go 1, and then two, three, four, five, like that, and add a centre block at the end, like so. So it's five back plus a centre block. And then we're going to build this back wall of this deck. It's going to be um, 19 wide, so that is uh, nine out each way. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine that way. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine that way. So it looks something like that. And then we, for for this deck, we've got to incorporate the bridge wings or the docking bridge wings. So out to the side, we've got the 19. And then from the from the 19, you want to build out five. So one, two, three, four, five. And these are curving forward slightly. So it's five like that. And then four, one, two, three, four. And then two, one, two, two again, one, two. And then forward two, one, two. And then curving back in slightly, we want two again, one, two, and uh, hang on, we want uh, two again, one, two like that. So it looks something like that, something like that. And then after that, we want um, eleven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven like that. And then curving outwards again, or, or sort of curving along the contours of the ship, we want. 10 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and then 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and then uh, 9 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 to there like that and that just <coughs> sorry that just stops one block short or sort of yeah sort of one block short of connecting to the white wall on the outside so that's fine there and then this last row of nine we just built, we're going to increase that to two blocks high. Like so. So just two blocks high for that section there. And uh, we'll worry about the rest of it in a minute. So I'll just do the other side quick. So the row of 19. And then we wanted uh, five out. So one, two, three, four, five. And then four. One, two, three, four. And then two rows of two. One, two, one, two. Two forward. One, two. And then curving in slightly. Two rows of two. One, two, one, two. And then 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And then curving out slowly, we want 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And then um, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 like that. And then we want 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 
just to connect or just short of connecting to the end there and then this row of nine we increase to two blocks high so one two three four five six seven eight nine like that so that's two blocks high there and then the rest will remain as one block high and then from the end of the nine we want to add an extra block to make it ten so build it two blocks high to connect it to there so make it it's ten blocks long and two blocks high and it connects to the end of that section there below so I just did the same on the other side add an extra block to make it 10 and double that in height like so so that now connects to the uh, superstructure like so now what we're going to do now is to add the overhang so we're going to go from the bottom of that row of 10 now so this block here we're going to build the overhang which is forward 30 blocks so I'm going to build it forward so 30 blocks forward so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 and make it 31 so so it connects to that section there and then from this block here we're going to add uh, uh, 81 so that's 8 1 blocks so we're going to build it along the side so I'm going to build it freehand and measure as I go so that's the first block and we want to build 81 so I won't bother counting it I just measure as we go but it's basically the, the, the length of the outside edge so just until the just build it forward until you get to the end of the outside edge and it should be okay so that should be 81 at least so, oh, there we go there's the end there so just build it and that is a measure it and it's 81 as it says at the end of that pink center so that's fine so that's 81 and then on the inside of that we want uh, 28 so on the inside here we want 28 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 uh, is it 28 29 right, I'll, I'll just measure this a section a second because I think I've gone slightly too short so let's go over to the prototype <laughs> and I believe it should be 28 so from there, minus one, so that's up to there. That's 28. And I believe that is fine, actually. So it's 28 plus, I think, four. But we'll go with it anyway. So it's 28. So that's 28. I just measure that, make sure that is 28. Sorry, I just measure that. So there to there. So I want 28 plus 1, so it's 29 effectively because I didn't measure the block behind. So I build that 29 and then add 3 on the inside, 1, 2, 3 and that connects to that pillar there on the front. So that is how that should be and uh, it don't look too bad. So that's the overhang added on one side. So I should do that the other side and I'll measure it properly. So <laughs> apologies there. So we go back to the other side to that row of 10 and then from that row of 10 we wanted, what was it? 30 so 31 in total so one from the row of the 10 we want 31 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 there we go and then after that we want 81 so one block plus the 80 so 81 in total right to the end of the outside edge basically all the way forward too far so that's 81 there that's fine and then we want 29 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 to 29 and then 3 1 2 3 to connect to that first pillar like so and there we go that is that section done there and the overhang is added and it don't look too bad marvelous brilliant beautiful and all things like that so that's that section done so what I'm going to do now look over what we just built and uh, ponder the next parts I think now we can add the deck so let me just go down and yeah I think we can add the deck now so when we add the deck you go to the front wall you either go to the front wall or the back wall but if you go to the front wall the deck will sit on the top or just on the inside of the top of the inside of the uh, front wall like so and when you build the deck down the side, the deck will sit on the inside of the overhang, like so, so sort of on this groove. So the deck will go all the way to the back end, and uh, it shouldn't look too bad. So I'll, it should go all the way down to the bridge wings as well, so the, the bridge wings will be filled in too. So what I'll do, 
I shall stand here and use the fill tool and that should fill in the deck all the way back so I should use fill wood by 400 and it should fill in the whole deck in theory and uh, everything should be fine, oh there we go so there's the deck added and it's gone all the way to the back end and to the front end and it don't look too bad so that's that bit done so just get under the back end and make sure the bridge wings are all filled out and yep that don't look too bad and the deck underneath or from the underneath is all coloured in nicely and yeah don't look too bad marvellous brilliant beautiful so that's what I'm going to do for now so I'm going to do another jump cut now I want to work out what to do next and then we can move on from there so um, back in a moment okay back again so what we're going to do now is move on to the next deck of the superstructure so we're going to go to the front wall of the deck we just added all the way down to here and we're going to go to the front wall which is this one here and on the wood we're going to count back to the 21st block back so that's 21 back so there's the first block there and count back 21 so that's 5 10 15 20 and 21 which is this block here so we'll put a marker center block there so that's the 21st block back and then we're going to build our wall from there and we're going to build a wall 13 wide so that's six other sides so one two three four five six that way one two three four five six that way so that's 13 wide like that and then out to the sides we want five one two three four five and it's curving slightly back so that's five and then we want four one two three four and then two rows of three one two three one two three and then two rows of two so one two and one two there so that last row of two connects to the front of the overhang so that's fine there so do the same on the other side we want five uh, one two three four five and then four one two three four and then three one two three three again one two three and then two one two two again one two like that and there we go so that's the uh, front wall done there and then what we're going to do is increase that to four high now so four blocks high all the way across from one side to the other so I probably want to do a jump cut for this one but we'll see actually I'll just do a copy paste so I do one side like so, so there's half of it done and that's increased to four high so I'm going to quickly copy to the other side so we do copy flip to the right and then paste and there we go that's both sides done and that's the front wall done like that so that's four wide uh, four high sorry and the full width of the ship and then what we want to do now is on the overhang down the side what we're going to do right right down to the back end where that row of nine is which is two blocks high or that row, row of ten now which is two blocks high we're going to add a line of blocks all the way down the side of the overhang and it's just one line okay so it's so that it makes it two blocks high so I add that line down the side without doing too much damage all the way down the side along the overhang to get to the back end where the um, that row of nine up to 10 or a row of 9 slash 10 is which is already two blocks high so I just want to connect to that at the back so just going down the side of the outside edge oh, and then to the next row and here we are coming up to the row we built already and connect to that and there we go that's where you want the, uh, the, uh, the overhang to end and we do the same the other side so I keep getting my words mixed up here so just go down to the other side and do the same there I could just use well did it for this one but some things don't require it although that does uh, so yeah go down the side and then the last row up to that row of 9 slash 10 at the back like so and there we are that is all connected up and it uh, don't look too bad so that's the, all done so we're going to go back to the front walls now and we're going to go to the side. We're going to add some side windows now. So back to the front of the, uh, the the curved front wall. And to the side here, which is on the overhang. And we're going to add some windows, which are going to be four windows, which are going to be two blocks high and in a group of four. So, well, four windows, basically. We'll build them two blocks high. So that's one window. And then one block gap. Add two windows. And then three windows. And then four windows. So you've got four windows, two blocks high, separated by a single block. And then we'll add the pillars in between, like so. 
and then after that fourth window you add a line of white in, uh, which is five long so one two three four five like that and then build that two blocks high and then we add another four block uh, four windows so that's one window two windows three windows four windows and then the pillars in between like so and then the row of five afterwards so one two three four five like that double that in height and then we add another four windows so that's one two three and four like so and then the pillars in between like so and then after that last set of windows you add a row of two two blocks high like that so there you go you got three rows of windows uh, or three rows of four windows and then what you want to do is on the top of those windows from that row of two here just build a line of blocks along the top of the windows all the way forward to connect to the front walls we just built a minute ago so build them all the way forward like so and there you go there's the windows attached like so and they don't look too bad so I'll just do the other side as quick as I can so we wanted four windows so that's one and then two three and four plus the pit pillars in between and then one two three four five times two and then the windows one two three four plus the pillars in between and then the five one two three four five times two high and then the four windows one two three four plus the pillars and then the row of two like that and then the row along the top of the windows like so and there we go there's our windows all sorted there brilliant so what we want to do now is to do the inside walls so we're going to go I'm going to work on the left side but it's the same on both sides so you don't really have to worry so for the inside walls you go to the end of the, the, of the windows on the side and go one block forward on the inside to this point here so you go from the end and go one block forward and then from here you're going to build the inside walls you're going to build inwards uh, five so that's one block already so that's one two three four five like that and then you want to build the sides 75 but first increase this to three high first like so and then afterwards you build a line of 75 so that's the first block there and then just build that a line of 75 down the side of the ship -da 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 and as, when we build these walls they're all going to be three blocks high in, at the end so don't worry too much about uh, how high they'll be so that's 75 there that's fine and then after the 75 we want 31 so that's the first block there and we want to make that 31 so build it down the side again 31 and that is 31 there and then after the 31 we want four one two three four and then two one two like that and then inwards two one two and then inwards 16 so uh, is it 16 no, 10, sorry, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And then a centre block like so. So that's the centre lined up like that. So uh, that, in theory, should match the set the other side. So uh, I'll do that quick, and then I'll do a jump cut and increase them in height. So I, don't, I just want to make sure this all lines up. So on the other side, 1 in from the end, 5 in. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then build that to 3 high. And then we want the line of 75. So I shall use the stack tool for this one just to save time. So I want to stack uh, 75. Right, so I just measure that. So that's 75 and that is 75, that's fine. And then we want 31. So I measure again. So that should be 31. No, that's 32, so 31 there like that. And then after the 31, we wanted uh, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 2, 1, 2. And then, uh, hang on, 41, oh, and then inwards 2, sorry, inwards 2 like that. And then 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And there we go, that's all lined up. I was a bit worried then, I thought I'd missed out a block, but uh, no, we're fine. So there we go, that's both sides lined up and it should in theory look something like that and then what you want to do is increase them all to three blocks high all the way around so just build it three high all the way around so I'm going to do a jump cut while I sort that out and then we can move on to the next part so uh, back in a moment okay back again so there's the walls all increased to three blocks high and it should in theory 
Not something like that. Um, don't look too bad, do it? So what we want to do now is go back to the side and back to where the windows were on the sides. So up to the windows here, so at the uh, walls here. And what we're going to do is from this corner block here, the one I just deleted, this block here, we're going to extend the side uh, along the top. So on, along the top only, so it's, it creates an overhang promenade. We're going to extend it by um, 75. So we want the first block there, and we want a line of 75. So that's two, and then all the way along. So 75 is what we're after. Should basically go to the end of the outside edge. But that's the theory because we're just basically following the contours of the outside of the ship. So I just build this line until I get to the end and see if that does measure up to 75. And is it? That is 75. That's fine. As you can see, it's the end of the outside edge. Or the, yep. So there we are. And then that's 75. And then we want 31. So once again, I'll measure it. So that's should be 31. And that should be the same again on the outside of the contours. And that's 31, that's fine. And then we want 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, like so. And then inwards, 17. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Plus a colour block to mark the centre, like so. And there you go, that is lined up with the centre, and that's fine. And that is the overhang sorted there. So I did the same on the other side. We get that to the line of 75. I won't bother measuring it. I just count. I won't bother counting it rather. I just build it freehand because I know where each section ends. Because we're just basically following the contours of the outside of the hull. So we want 75 along here. Right. So, so there's the 75, and then 31. Like so, and then the 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and then the 17 in. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and there we go. That's all lined up, and that creates the uh, the upper prom uh, the upper promenade. So that's basically what is now the supports for the boat deck, and uh, it don't look too bad. So what we can do now is add the deck, and uh, start adding the deck inside the uh, overhang like so. And this deck would go from the back here all the way to the front wall and sit on top of these inside walls as well. So uh, I should use the fill tool to fill in all the deck. And it should just go all the way forward. And we should be okay. So fill wood by 400. And this should fill in fairly quickly. And oh, there we go. That is all filled in. And it should look something like that. So you can see you've got the overhang, uh, the overhanging promenade there. It's all uh, enclosed and it don't look too bad so that wood deck has gone all the way forward as it should and there we go so like before we've done on the inside here so these inside walls like before you can start adding the doors and windows to these I'll do these between now and the next part so uh, or the next video so uh, don't worry about too, uh, too much about them and uh, there we go so that is that deck done there so uh, what I'm going to do now I'm going to do another jump cut while I work out what to do next and then uh, we can move on so um, back in a moment Right, back again, so what we're going to do now is work on the next deck of the superstructure. So we're going to go to the front wall again of the deck we just built, all the way up here, and we're going to add the bridge wings as well. So go to the front wall here on the centre, and what we're going to do from the centre on the wood, we're going to count back to the fourth block. So we go one, two, three, and four, and put our colour block there. So it's the fourth block back on the wood. And then the front wall of this deck house is going to be 11 wide, so that is... Uh, five either side so one two three four five that way one two three four five that way like so and then we want uh four out one two three four and then uh two one two like that i think that's right in it so it's 11 wide four two and then yeah so i think that's right so i do the, <laughs> do the same on the other side so it's out four one two three four and then two one two and then the sides are 11 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 and then we go out 3 1 2 3 and then the side is 105 so I shall build the first block actually I'll, I'll just I'll just use stack so we just want a line of 103 so I use stack uh, 100 and 100, 105 sorry 105 so there we go there's the line added there so I just measure that to make sure so it's out three, and then from there 105. So I just measure as I go along. 
So that is 105, that's fine. So it's 105 down the side. And at the end of the 105, we want to build inwards three. So one, two, three, like that. So you can see the front wall over there, then the 105, and then inwards three. And then forward again, we want four. One, two, three, four. And then inwards eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight plus a colour block to mark the centre, and that in theory should be the centre so it should look something like that, I just do the other side get those out of the way, so we've got the front wall done, so we just want the sides now, we want the sides of 11 so it was 11 wide, 4, 2 and then 11 back, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and then out 3, um, 1, 2, 3 and then the line of 105 like so, so I just measure as I go along, so that should be 105 again. Right, so, so there's 105, and then we want to build out uh, inwards 3, um, so 1, 2, 3, and then forward 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and then inwards 8, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and that lines up with the centre, like so, and there you go, that's that deck house wall all laid out, it should look something like that, in theory. Now what we're going to do now is go to the front wall and we're going to start the bridge wings now. So we go down to the very tip of the front wall, or the front wall here, and the front wall here we're going to increase that to 4 high, like so. So it's 4 high like that, and then the next row, the row of 4 here, we're going to increase that to 4 high as well, like so, and do the same on the other side. like that, and then from the row of four at the top, so this top block here, we're going to add one block like that, so the row of four, add one block there, and then we're going to add, curving backwards slightly, uh, three rows of five, so one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, like that, you can't really see it, but there you go, so three rows of five out, um, and then back two, one, two, and then back inwards, twelve, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 there, and then down to connect to the to the wall foundations below. And it should look something like that. So I do the same on the other side. So from that row of 4 at the top, add 1, like that, and then 3 rows of 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then 2 back, 1, 2, and then 12 back in. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 and then two down to connect to the foundations below and there you go, there's the bridge wings and then the, the area between the pillar of the bridge wings and the front wall on this foundation here, you increase that to three high like so, and do the same on the other side so when we come to add the deck, the deck will sit on top of these inside walls like so and then the rest of the walls, all the way down the back, across the other side and back at the other side increase that to four high so you want to build the walls four high all the way down the side like so, I should use quartz, uh, set quartz to do this. So that's that pit down there, and then all the way down the side of 105. Build it four high down the back, uh, down to the back. Like so, and then around the back end, like so. And then up the other side. Like so. And then up the other side. And I do these last few sections by hand. And there we go, there's those walls done. And that's all increased to four blocks high. And that is the last deck of the superstructure um, in this area. So that is pretty much done. So we'll just add the, add the deck now. So you add the deck on the insides of the bridge wings like so. <coughs> Pardon me. And then this, <coughs> Pardon me. this deck will go all the way to the back end. <coughs> like I just showed. I've got the bloody hiccups now. So I'm going to use the fill tool to fill in this deck. And it shouldn't take too long. Yeah, well, there we go, that was uh, sorted there, and there you go, there's the bridge wings all filled in and the deck goes all the way to the back end 
of that deck house and it should look something like that. Marvellous. And as before, you can start adding the doors or windows to these walls if you want to. And uh, everything should look okay. So that's that section done. And that's all I'm going to do for today because we've got quite a bit done. Um, that's four decks I think we built. So the lower deck, the main deck, the next and the next. That's four, five decks I think. Um, yeah, I think we've done five decks. That's not bad, is it, for uh, one ship? And uh, yeah, we're going to leave it at that for now. So that is it for part three. Part four will be uh, the ship's wheelhouse and the fuddle supports and anything else I could think of along the way. There's still plenty more detail to go on, but we'll uh, see when we get to it. And uh, we'll uh, see how things get on. We've got pillars to do as well, but we'll sort them out as well. So, um, like I say, we'll uh, sort things out when we get to it. But that is it for part three. So for part four, it's just what I explained, and I shall leave you to it. So this is Rich, signing off, logging off, disappearing, and I shall return in part four. So uh, bye for now.